Hello and welcome to this quick walkthrough of the LC Toolkit. This allows USB communication and configuration of the LCA20 and LCD20 via a PC using our PGM1 cable. Today we will be using the LCD20. We can see the home page where we can connect to a module for configuration. Once connected, we see the information page that can also be used as a display. Information on the various settings is available here. Here, we can save and restore settings for the connected module. This page shows the real-time trend chart and this page enables logging. Next, we can see the analog output configuration page. Several methods are available. We use this page to configure the two relays. We can change source, set point, hysteresis, and whether the relay is inverted or latched. The graph illustrates the current functionality. The measurement page is a flowchart showing a visualisation of what happens to the calibrated value to give the displayed value. Here we have system zero, zero tracking and tear. We can see and reset values for peak, valley and snap and route the source to the display. The two digital inputs can be set here. The LCD20 allows a choice of zero, relay reset, display defaults, gross, net, peak, valley or snap, peak and valley reset, shunt cal on, off or toggle and snap. The calibration page allows input sensitivity selection and up to 10 point live calibration. Here we have up to 10 point table calibration and the advanced page allowing editing of the individual gains and offsets if you desire. Here we can set up shunt calibration and this page shows calibration information. The filtering page allows changing of data rate and the option of block averaging or a digital low pass filter. Finally, we have the lock page, which allows pages in the toolkit to be locked out when the enable toolkit link is not fitted on the LCD20. This brings us to the end of this walkthrough. If you're considering the LCD20 for your application, I'd recommend you download the software and trial the demo version on your computer or laptop. You can then explore the software in your own time. Thank you.